Welcome back to Amnesia the Bunker. Last episode we got the lighter, which is going to allow us to throw Molotov cocktails and deal with the rats, and also light the torch, which also will scare off rats, at least temporarily. And that is going to allow us to properly explore the maintenance section, because it is absolutely full of rats. We also found the fuel storage right there, which is going to give us a unlimited, as far as I know, as far as I hope, unlimited supply of fuel, so we can fill up any of these bottles that need it. I've got two with cloth, but no no gas. Uh, this one's fully complete, and this one's just the bottle. Yeah, also bringing a torch with me, just to get them out of the way. Make sure I can get to the fuel storage just fine, because I only have one actual petrol bomb. Yeah, let's go for it. And I'm also taking the pillbox key with me, so we can enter the pillbox while we're there, hopefully. This thing is completely full, so it should last quite a good while. I forgot to check how much ammo I have. Do I have enough ammo to even fend off the creature? I don't remember. Goal here is to burn all the bodies. Did it just... Oh my god. Oh, it went back up. Good. Uh, I have two shots. Okay, yeah, we're staying crouched for a little bit. No, it sounds like it went away. Okay. I wonder how long the torch lasts for. What? Uh, I guess I go more this way. I'm trying to find the way to the fuel storage. Wasn't it? I thought it was through there. How would I get in there? All oh, right, there's the brick. It's not gonna open that door though. It's a metal. Ah, here's how we get to fuel storage. Yes. How loud is a petrol bomb going to be? I don't know. Not too bad. Oh, it's a flare. Guess I don't really need that at the moment. Okay, fuel storage. Beautiful. Beautiful. So much fuel. Mm. Alright, I've got two throwable ones. I don't know, there can't be that many bodies, right? That should be enough. I think. Man, I sure wish I just 
had a map. No, don't pick that up. Let's craft a third one. Now we got three petrol bombs. That should be more than enough. Oh. Oh, it's the tunnel. Oh, do I want to bother cleaning out the tunnel? Does it matter? I think I do. At least partially. Okay. Let's free up some inventory space. Using the key here. In fact, let's just let's just go. Oh. Brick. I am probably gonna want you. Oh, that could totally be broken through, yeah. Don't think it heard that. Wait. No, no, no. It it did. I, I think it just came out. Hmm. I'm going up. Oh my god, is that daylight? Holy shit. Whoa! Fuck! I think we better stay crouched. Stafford. Amazing just to see that little glimpse of daylight. Okay. Let's make another petrol bomb. Oh, right, it's, it's empty. I kind of want that grenade. It was a shotgun shell, so we're going to find a shotgun at some point. I saw its face. When it took Trembly, I saw its face. As it tore into him, it looked right at me. And I think... I think maybe... Maybe it knew who I was. What the hell is it? Okay, let's clear out more of this.
I didn't even need to use my torch. Oh, how are we doing on time, by the way? Oh, we're fine. More than half time left. Okay, what more do I want to explore up here? Is there more to explore in maintenance? I'm not bleeding. Oi. I think I am. Oh, that doesn't open. Oh, shit. Pantry. here? I don't think there was. No, not really. Oh, shit. Am I still bleeding? I guess it's not going to go away until I heal myself, huh? Oh, they're following me. Okay. I think it's time to use this. Provides a very nice amount of light. As aside from that one mysterious room, I don't think there's anything more to explore. In that one room, I feel like. Get out of here. I feel like there was a, um. Like a vent that I could get through if I had the right tool. And that perhaps would lead there? Yeah, down there, there's also a vent. Oh, that didn't last long. how much fuel oh I used all my bottles shit <laughs> I wanted to see how much fuel we could get from them but yeah I'm guessing half the amount as what's in the tanks we actually have one more we can get this thing back up to full
think I'm gonna keep the grenade on me. Oh, I'm still hurt, aren't I? Yeah. This should be enough. We're not hurt too bad. Yeah, yeah, we're fine now. All right. All right. We have Stafford's code. Four six thirty. Oh, yes, wrench. socket wrench that can remove a certain kind a certain kind of screws? I don't think that's grammatically correct. But anyway yeah, I can use that for any of the vents. I do wonder if there was also a pry bar and if that would work because it shows a pry bar being used here in this picture. Oh, I, it shows both, doesn't it? Yeah, there's a socket wrench there. Maybe they're trying to emphasize that either way it would work. I'm not sure. But that is going to open up a lot of things. Um, I can think of two vents. Wait, three? Yeah, I can I can think of three vents off the top of my head, and there's probably almost certainly more. Why does it list the exit as a like quest area? I mean I know I have the explosives, but I don't have a detonator. I don't know, can I just go place it? Does it want me to just place it there? God, you can hear sounds of warfare out there. Sounds so close. Oh yeah, there's no handle for this thing. listed there. But yeah, the detonator's in the Roman tunnels down here. What did I need to get into this area? I need bolt cutters. Yeah, there was that unbreakable chain. Okay, let's get suited up for opening some thingies. Do I want a grenade on me? Now that I've got, what, three rounds? I feel better about not keeping a grenade on me. But I am going to keep the lighter for sure. Petrol bomb would be nice, but I don't think any of these are full. Empty bottle, empty bottle, empty bottle. Nah. Well, uh, I think I'm okay with what I have. Let's turn the generator on. I 
thought there was one just, like, right out here. I guess I remembered that wrong. Surely attract the thing, but you know what? I'm gonna do it. Ah, shit. Well, that didn't go so great. Am I leaking? I'm leaking. back to that later. It's It could take minutes for that to dissipate. that they make you do each one individually. Empty, empty, empty. Oh, oh, it's just bottle storage. Oh, this is going to come in handy. I'm Sergeant Reynard, Neuer's Translations, 18th of May. From Reynard to M. Fournier and D. Blanchett. The Rue reports that Neuer is the source of the problem. He is going around telling the men that these damned texts contain accounts of pagan rituals performed in those tunnels. Ghastly and wild stories. Now superstition and rumors are passed around among the men like an open flask or venerable disease. Some even say they have seen the things. Ghosts, demons, fairies. Instead of the Angel of Mons, I'm afraid we have the Devils of Poseries? I've called Neuer for reprimanding. I'll make sure it is appropriately severe. Meanwhile, the engineers will continue to dig. A stick. Also from Reynard, list of the guilty, 9th of June. Sabotage has left the tunnel project in ruins. At approximately 2300 hours, or 2330? I don't know how you say that. Uh, on the 2nd of June, an explosion ripped through the tunnel system. It was quickly determined that explosives were missing from the arsenal and the explosion was no accident. After a swift investigation, the following soldiers have confessed to sabotage. 
Gaspar LaRue, Johannes Nicolet, Toussaint Buffoy, Jean Renoir, and Ozan, Ozan Zabel. Four of the guilty now rot in the cells awaiting tribunal. The fifth, Toussaint, remains unaccounted for. He may have been killed in the blast. I believe there are others involved, but as of yet, no one will say anything. Worse than double agents, these men are cowards. They scream about ghosts and demons and other worlds. They claim they committed this act of treason to save their fellow soldiers from hell. Utter nonsense. We are still working to clear the tunnel site and assess the damage, but I fear that any hope of using them for our purposes is now lost. In addition, the explosion has caused other structural damage to the bunker itself. Flooding is now occurring in various areas. Hmm. I wonder if I'm going to have to deal with the floods when I get to the Roman tunnels then. That should be interesting. Yeah, so do I want to take any bottles with me? I mean... I need fuel. I don't think I want this stick on me. I mean, there's a million bottles over there. What am I doing? I should leave these here. I can still hear the gas at Reynard's place. Ah. That's how you get in here, yes. I need something to deal with the rats, though. Yeah, let's head over to the fuel storage. Oh, hey. Did I never see that? Oh, well, no password on it, so I didn't really miss anything. I think we have some bottles and maybe some fabric up here. I actually wait, I do need that grenade. I only have one round. fully explore this area. Ah, oh, yes. Hmm. I don't need that flare. like another bottle. I'm sure there's one around here. There's one. But yeah, I don't really think there's any... No, okay, there's one more. But I'm gonna have to stop well, use my own stocks and then stop by that area we just opened up at some point soon.
I don't need another grenade. I don't need to unlock that door. places have something that I can wrench. Almost certainly, but I don't know them off the top of my head. And we have two more passwords to try, which might get us the bolt cutters. And that would allow us to do quite a bit. Yeah. through the other door. I'm just wondering when I'm going to need to burn them. Okay, how much fuel does this give me? Oh no. I think if it has cloth in it, you can't pour it out? Is that true? What if... Hold on. Surely not. The icon to fill it isn't appearing. It's just gonna explode in my face if I do that. Can I uncraft it? I don't see any option to do that. Shit. Alright. I think I need to go make a fuel run. Okay, we are about to do a very high risk operation. I have nothing on me except my gun with two rounds, which should be enough to fend it off if it comes to that. I need all this inventory space for a very big fuel run. I need to be extra sure I don't attract it, given my lack of defenses, so I am not going to sprint. Okay. Please. Yes! Oh, thank god. So, let's see how much we get. Oh, wow! Was that really just one? I was expecting half of what you get from a can, which is... I think a can will take you two of these ticks, so if it was here, then it would take you one tick, two ticks. Like, the, the big ticks. This... Takes you... I think the same amount? Oh my god. Well, in that case, I have a lot of fuel. Honestly, I wasn't even expecting to get this generator full with what I took back. Okay, well, we're good for a while. Let's go see what we can get with our new passwords. Oh. Yeah, I don't have much space. I'll generally keep one petrol bomb on me. Definitely the flashlight, lighter, and the wrench. And one petrol bomb.
de Bardeen, 1454. Some ammo. G. Travers, 1610. grenades. What is left to open? A Lambert. Is that it? Yeah. And I don't know where those bolt cutters are, but I need them. Before I forget, let's go take a look at Reynard's room. I think it was Reynard, the person whose door I blew up and then had to run because it was gassing. Yeah, this one. Fournier, 6th of June, from Fournier to Reynard. Further to your investigation of the tunnel's sabotage, your assumptions are safe. Start with those who spread the rumors about magic and devilry in the tunnels. Clearly they've had sabotage in their minds for weeks. Use any means necessary to elicit confessions. We cannot allow this treason to go unpunished. that open right now. Major Blanchett. Reynard, I want you to personally oversee nighttime security in the tunnels. The last two nights I've heard someone moving through the quarters when there was no patrol scheduled. I will not have another bout of sabotage. If emergency lockdown becomes necessary, find Delisle. He keeps the necessary lockdown wheels tucked away in mission storage. Oh, that is... that is very, very old news now. Think that's it. Yep. Alright, well, I think I'm going to end the episode here, so I hope you've enjoyed so far, and when I return, we need to get the bolt cutters, and I'm... Um, thinking we should look in the prison and the soldier quarters. I know we've been there before, but it's been a long time, and I'm certain that there's going to be some things we can open with the wrench, and some things we can open with explosives, i.e. locked wooden doors. 